It's called <laughs> post dates. And um, so I came across an article in TechCrunch about post dates. And what it is, is it's like Postmates, except they pick up your stuff from your ex. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, so, it, and then it's kind of along, I guess, along the, the, the vein of they did something earlier this year. I forget what it was, but it was a parody thing and they raised a lot of money. Um, but this is, <laughs> it's New York and LA right now, uh -huh. because of course. And, uh, but you choose your relationship level, um, you know, what, how close you hold, guys were. Hold on, hold on. Um, I, I, like, I, I, I got to read some of these for the audio. Uh, <laughs> in the choose your relationship, uh, casually dated, lived together, one night stand. By the the pictures that go with this are fantastic. Uh, uh, hooked up, seriously dated. Uh, these are different levels, I guess. Uh, went back to your ex, uh, other, divorced, and friend zoned is this one down here with the little happy ball. So, <laughs> wow. So yeah. Yeah, so there's, they have people signed up for it, and um, there's rumors that they had people actually do this. So, uh, yeah, you, you call, and it has to be a mutual thing. Like, you can't be yeah, – is it for real? Yes. Like, actually, yes. We are fully operational in New York City and Los Angeles for limited time only. Um, you create an account. Like, you have to let the other person um, – no, you know, give them kind of a heads up or not because this one is like, I don't know where my ex lives, so I need their address. They're like, nope, just their cell phone number. So they'll text your ex for you. Um, if you end up completing the order, that's when they charge you. Why did you do this? Because no one else did? Question mark. <laughs> I love so. This, uh, this, I, well, I'm, I'm reading along this, and it talks about how this was like a pop up business, and it says it's what happens when uh, Annie and Susie uh, take another idea too far. <laughs> so, <Yes. laughs> this is the thing I miss. Remember, they were like everybody had an app and a service, and it was like a crazy idea, and some of them become, you know, TikTok or Uber or something, right? Um, like uh, this is a little wilder and probably low, low, lower end, but still, like I miss these weird ideas. Um, um, kind of rolling out and just kind of happening like this, right? Yes. <laughs> it's like there's a whole list of things they won't delete. Transport, pet fish, dog, cat, gun, <laughs> meth, bow and arrow, nuclear matter, wine. <laughs> nuclear <laughs> matter? <laughs> <laughs> oh, geez. Um, yeah, okay. Getting ahead of it. I I'm glad that they had a good conversation with legal on this, I guess. Uh, so... <laughs> So postdates.co if you want to check this out or have, yeah. or have need of their services in one of the uh, major cities that they're a part of. Well, they, um, they have the reverse, too. Not only can you request stuff, but you can send stuff. Yeah, yeah. So, like, if you <laughs> want to give stuff back and don't want to have to deal with the hassle of seeing that other person. Which means the, the people that put this together have had, had to do this a few times, probably. And that's why they're like, there should be a service. <laughs> So, hey, that can be really handy handy for some people out there, right? So, uh, 